The search continues for a missing senior citizen who hasn't been seen or heard from since leaving a hospital in Portsmouth. News 3's Danielle Seda spoke with the man's brother who is asking the public to help find his family member. The Portsmouth Police Department say that 77-year-old Roger Hammond was last seen near the 3600 block of High Street. His family tells us that he's very vulnerable, not just because of his age, but because he's without his medication. In the time that his older brother has been missing, Larry Jackson says he's going to honor a promise if he can be brought home. I said, we're going to go to an Eagles game. If he's phys physically and mentally able to, that would be like a highlight for him. Jackson says Roger previously lived in Philadelphia, but he was no longer able to care for himself. Their other brother brought him down to Portsmouth, Virginia, so he could be close to his siblings. A few weeks ago, Jackson says Roger was having a mental crisis and was taken to the hospital by police. His family found out that he was discharged and haven't seen him since. Jackson says he circled the area where Hammond was last seen from scouting out homeless shelters. They're homeless. I went to the homeless shelter today on Green Street to hopefully, you know, the detective suggested maybe he, he got in with, you know, homeless people there or they feed uh, certain hours, you know, certain days of the week. To putting up flyers. I posted those until I ran out of posters. And um, mostly the more high exposure areas, you know, like I said, the entrances to the strip malls, the exits. According to the National Missing and Unidentified Person System, over 600,000 people go missing every year. And specifically in Virginia, there are 339 open missing person cases. Jackson believes he's learned the hard way how serious and heartbreaking a missing persons case can be. You never, you never think that it can happen to you, that it can happen to your family. The police have asked nearby businesses to check their cameras to see if Hammond has been spotted. Jackson says he has a request as well to say something if you see something or someone. I would encourage anybody who happens to see Roger to at least it, take a minute. Even if it's not him, there's a chance that it could be. And call the police. In Chesapeake, Danielle Seda, News 3. And this footnote, as of today, according to police, there have been no new leads to his brother Roger's whereabouts. Now, here's some more information on this missing persons case. Portsmouth police say since Roger Hammond was voluntarily transported to the hospital, they just gave him a ride. Police say they were not required to stay there once he was turned over to the hospital. Police tell News 3 he hasn't been seen since and he was discharged from the hospital. But if you have any information on his whereabouts, you're encouraged to call Portsmouth Police.